So another problem dealing with applications of inequalities. We're told that Sergio and Lizeth have a very tight vacation budget. They plan to rent a car from a company that charges $75 a week plus 25 cents a mile. How many miles can they travel during the week and still keep within their $200 budget? So first off, what are we looking for? It's right here in the last sentence. How many miles can they travel during the week? So how many miles can they travel? So we're looking for the number of miles. So we'll let M equal the number of miles. Now let's write out in a sentence basically what we're told as far as the cost is concerned. To rent their vehicle, we're told that it's $75 a week plus 25 cents per mile. And they only have a $200 budget, so we know that it is at most $200. Now we trans that, translate that into an inequality. I'm going to go ahead and put the uh, 25 cents per mile up front because that's where the, the variable is going to be, per mile. So it's 0 0.25 times, we let M be the number of miles, so M plus 75 is at most. So it's going to in include the equal sign because it can be up to $200 but it can't be more than $200. So we know that at most is less than or equal to because it's either the, the amount that they have, which is $200, or less than $200. And now we just solve as we normally would. We subtract 75 from both sides. We get 0 0.2525 cents per mile times the number of miles is less than or equal to 125, divide both sides by 0 0.25, and we get M, the number of miles, is less than or equal to 500 miles. 125 divided by 0 0.25 is 500. So tentatively, we're saying they can travel up to 500 miles. Now, as always, we want to check this. So how do we check this? Well, let's make sure that 0 0.25, 25 cents per mile times 500 miles plus the $75. Well, that equals 125 plus 75, which equals $200. So traveling 500 miles it will cost them exactly $200.